Um, do something about Zed. He's D tier right now, and it's going to be even worse. So I just have, like, I'm just going to be very honest with you. That's what we're doing. The lore of the day is honesty. Um, you're right, Zed is weak. Um, it is intentional. Uh, Zed must be kept weak because he is the most frustrating champion in League of Legends. And so for all of eternity, Zed will probably be slightly weaker than he should be because of how often he is banned and how frustrating. So one of the Zed's issues is that um, his, he has unclear counterplay to, to um, lower skilled players in regards to what you're supposed to do against him with his laning pattern. I think that is like one of the things that I, I uh, go, is going on. The other thing is that I think that Zed is the reason one of the one of the big reasons Zed is the most frustrating assassin in League of Legends is uh, Zed is he tortures you. Um, and what I mean by that is Zed ult. Uh, you look at it and it's actually got a lot of counterplay, which by the way makes him weak in high MMR. He ults you and then there's like three seconds for like you can run away, you can get shielded, you can heal, etc., etc., etc. But to a especially a low MMR player who's getting ulted by Zed, the experience is he ults me, he does a blah, 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 he blinks away and then puts on his sunglasses and goes cool guys don't look at explosions and walks away and you explode, right? And you're like that wasn't fair. What was I supposed to, what? Right, and so 